seems like a good area, so we're gonna go ba bloop and we're gonna angle it up. What happens when we do that? Oh yeah, we're magic folks. Uh, yeah, we are. Uh, we're doing it with the physics here. Uh oh. Yep, we're gonna have to abandon the ship. No. No. Oh crud. Uh, what happens when we click this button and this one? Huh. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs>、Komodo、Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Stormworks Build and Rescue. And today we're going to be checking out some workshop creations. Now, if you're asking where career mode is, I'm currently doing some work offline or off camera, I should say, and doing some missions and grinding away. But a lot of the missions right now are really just rescue missions. But、uh, we've seen a lot of those is basically go to a location, pick up the people, then take them over to another location. Uh, so I'm doing a little bit of grinding away at that, but I wanted today actually play with some really cool creation stuff that we wouldn't have in the career mode. So we're gonna do that here today. Now I do want to thank you guys for all the love and support on the Stormworks series.、Uh, if you want to see more of this on the channel, maybe hit that thumbs up button. And if you want to get in on the Stormworks Alpha, that will be linked down in the description too. But anyways, let's go ahead and jump right into this. All right, so today we're gonna start this off big. I love massive ships on Stormworks; they're so fun to operate. And I have a—it says small, but it's a container ship. So let's go ahead and see what small container ship. Oh, is that—is that small? No, that's not small. That's actually pretty big. I mean, it's not like a full-size container ship. That's actually quite impressive. Look at that. All right, I can definitely—you can tell—you can walk around on it. Can you go under the?、Uh, Under the deck, I don't know. Let's see if this will spawn. Sometimes with these big creations, they've been known to freeze up the game just a bit. So here we go. Oh oh oh! Wait, what the heck? Is it popping a willy here?、Oh, it seems like the back might be a little bit heavy, but I think once this thing starts to go,、uh, this will work pretty good. Kind of curious if this could handle some really like high seas. I'm not sure. <laughs> Let's jump in the water and check this thing out real quick. Ah, this is quite amazing. Now, this is something that I really wish I could do in Stormworks, but I just—it's not that I don't have the patience. It's more like a time thing. I believe I could probably figure out creations like this. And how the heck do I get up on this thing? Hold on, I'm gonna figure out how to get up here. But yeah, it'd be something that I'd eventually want to do. All right, so I've made two circles around the ship, and I cannot find a ladder to get on board. So if I fall off this at sea, I am d totally screwed. So let's go ahead and try to jump. Come on! No, <laughs> no.、Uh, is there a quick way to get in? Can I do it from the map? No, that takes it to the workbench. Okay, well, we're gonna figure out how to get this thing, or at least get on this thing. Maybe I can approach it from the side. Maybe that's a smaller jump. I don't know. Okay, so I've done two circles around the boat, and I'm trying to figure out how to actually get on it. I can't quite make the jump, and I don't see a ladder. Not unless I'm completely blind. I even thought about maybe lowering the.、Uh, The magnet down and trying to move the boat, but I don't think that's possible. So I kind of feel like I need to grab a helicopter real quick, land on the boat, and jump in it to check it out、uh, because I don't, I don't see a ladder at all. So <laughs> it seems like maybe I should try to find a different way to do this, but I want to do this with a helicopter. So all right, we're gonna use the old Komodo heli here to try to get on top of this ship.、Uh, oh boy, yeah, I can land on those containers, I believe. Let's go ahead and go over this. Wouldn't this be a really inconvenient way to、uh, actually get on your ships instead of using a dock? You know, something I'd like to see. I'd actually like to see a maybe a folding dock, or maybe even just for people. If it would just come out and you can actually、uh, maybe get on some of these、uh, ships here. I think we can.、Uh, can we land here? Is that a thing? Yeah, I think that's flat enough.、Uh, okay, come on, come on, land the Komodo heli on here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, that's not good. Hold on. Here we go. Right there. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and kill this thing. Oh, this thing's bright. Whoa. Something is letting off a lot of reflection over here. That's a that's apparently a thing right now. Let's go ahead. Go out this side. All right. So we are officially on the boat. The boat is. What's it doing? No. No, the boat's capsizing now. What the heck? <laughs> I just want to play with the boat. Hold on,、uh, we need to find the captain's quarters. Uh, oh, uh oh, there's water filling up the boat. No, <laughs> what? 
<laughs> Why can't I play with this boat? <laughs> I just want to play with the boat. Come on, game. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> All right, so we have capsized the boat. And we've probably lost the helicopter. Can we go under this? Let's see if we can go underwater here and try to get out. Uh, oh, there's a helicopter. Dang it, we have capsized a cargo ship in the harbor. How in the heck do you do that? You know, I got another plan. What if I were to change the weather and make it really, really intense as far as the waves? Maybe this thing will lean over to one side and I can jump on it. Uh, it's kind of a weird plan, I know, but I feel like this might work. So, look at all the water that's gone from the harbor here, or the little dock. Now, oh, yeah, it's jumping up high. I just needed to move a bit. Oh, you can see the magnet bouncing up and down. Hold on, if it's low like that, I could time this out. Uh, okay, let's wait for the next wave to come in. We're going to get it really low, and we're going to run, and... No! <laughs> no! Dang it! Guys, look at this. I think we can get on here. <gasps> We're on. Okay, okay. We need to stop the weather. The weather's going to capsize the boat. Let's go ahead and stop the wind. Stop the wind. That is a really inconvenient way to get on this boat, but we are on the boat now. Now, we got to get this thing out into the uh, water here before we capsize it once again. Oh, we are... Are you... Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Why? Why is this a thing? I want to play with this so bad, but I can't. All right, so normally I don't like to edit anybody's baby because this is something that somebody has taken a lot of time and created, but I'm going to add some ladders here. I mean, this this is something that I feel like is a necessity. I might even take off a little bit of railing. So let's go ladder, ladder, ladder. This is all in the name of being able to play with this thing because this looks amazing. I just, you know, would like to actually be able to play with it. So we're going to cut off some railing right there. There we go. All right, so we should be good to go to spawn this and jump on it. There we go. Hey, there it is. All right. Can I play with this now? Yay. I think I can be able to get on it now. <laughs> All right, so let's get on the ladder. There we go. All right. Oh, check this out. This is cool. Oh, that's a little low. Let's hop into here. Oh, yeah, so we got all the containers here. Is there... Can we go below... Uh oh Is that... What is this? Oh, this is Stormworks. I keep forgetting about the way the water lines work. So say if you had, like, an under-the-deck kind of situation, if the water line's above it, it's going to fill the compartments. I wonder if that's something that they're going to plan on. I don't know if you can adjust that, make it to where if you have, like, a big hole or something, you can actually be able to go down it and not be flooded. Uh, but anyways, let's try to figure out how to get up on top of this. I'm assuming this is over here. There we go. There's that. Okay, it's a little empty area. I want to figure out how to pilot this thing or, or drive it or whatever you want to call it. All right. Oh, here we go. Sweet. All right, so we got our controls here. Let's jump in the pilot seat and let's fire this bad boy up. So this is, this is toggle buttons. Okay, let's just toggle all the buttons. There we go. Assuming that fired those up. Do we have any lights in here? Do we see any switches for lights? Uh, whoa! Hold on. This thing sounds different than any ship that I've, that I've tried before. I wonder if there's a different motor or something? It's got a kind of a weird sound. Whoa, this thing is actually really smooth. This works really good. <laughs> You know, once you uh, actually figure out how to get on it, uh, did I miss any ladders anywhere? I probably needed to read the instructions one more time. Maybe he had a way. And wait a minute. Was the way to get on this under it? I see the hole, or there's a, you can go down, and I don't know if you can go down into the ship, or what that is. I wonder if there's a way under the ship to get up in it. I have a feeling there's a hole in the bottom, is there? Now, it's kind of hard to see here. I don't see a visible hole, but... The one thing I like to test out in Stormworks, anytime I play with a creation, something like this, it's this awesome. I want to see what this thing does in high seas. Now, <laughs> this thing did tip over in the dock, but sometimes the water, I think how it goes into that dock, it's really rough compared to if you were on open water here. So, let's play with the creative menu. Let's go here. And let's kick that wheel. Let's just go full on hurricane here. There we go. Uh, let's get a little bit more light here. Uh, well, there isn't much light that you can get in these type of seas. All right, so let's try to let's try to make this thing work here. Here we go. Let's get jump in. 
Alright, here we go. Now we're fighting the seas. Uh, this is like my favorite part of the game. You know, I like doing the rescue missions and everything, but getting to play with big creations like this and just jacking up the, uh, the wind as far as it'll go, that's actually quite awesome. This ship is cool, though. I like this. I like the lights. Uh, this would look cool. What does this look like at night? Like, how scary is this? This is like one job that I don't think I could ever have. Whoa. Yeah, no way. Oh, that is so cool. Guys, guys, uh, we might need to be rescued here very soon. Come on. Okay, I'm going to hit it to the... Can this thing tip itself back? <gasps> Whoa. How did that correct itself? I thought for sure we were going over in the uh, in the water there. Uh oh, we're going over this side now. Come on. Counter. Counter it. You know, surprisingly, the, the seas aren't too bad here. I've seen much worse, and oh boy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This might be uh, some sort of ship sinking simulator. No! Huh. How is this thing doing that? It's actually correcting itself. That's quite fantastic. Wait a minute. Oh, no, we're not going to be able to correct ourselves from this. Oh, that is a big wave. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> would this be a call for a bandit ship here? Uh-oh. Yep, we're going to have to abandon the ship. No. No. Oh, crud. Oh, boy. Oh, uh-oh. No, oh, are we going all the way over? Hold on. What does this look like from the inside? Oh, that is terrifying. Oh, wait. Wait, ship's coming back up. No, it isn't. Nope. Actually, it's going back over. Well, that's a problem. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can hop out here. Oh, are we floating? Dude, that is so cool. That's kind of trippy, actually. Oh, wait, no, we're, we're tipping back. Whoa, <laughs> we just got hit by a big wave. Oh, this is cool. Okay, can we get out of this thing? Uh, they had to make scenarios like that. We have, like, sinking ships. I think we're all the way upside down, are we not? Uh, where's the exit? Oh, here it is. Alright, let's see if we can get to the surface here. Our ship has capsized. All right, well, let's go ahead and jump onto the next creation. That thing is cool. Once you figure out how to get on it, I like that. That is, uh, that's very awesome. All right, so for the next creation, we actually have, I believe this is from the movie Avatar. It's the SA-2 Samson. Uh, this actually, whoa, dude. Check that out. That would be like the ultimate rescue machine right there. That'd be cool to see. All right, let's go ahead and uh, let's load this bad boy up and just kind of see what happens here. I should probably read the instructions on this one, but nice. Check that out. Okay, so uh, how does this thing work? We can climb in. Okay, so it's got what six seats in the back. Not bad. It's actually really nice looking. I love the colors. Uh, now, question is, how do we get into the cockpit? Do we just walk in? That's passenger seat. This would be the pilot seat, right? All right. Whoa. Check these buttons out. Okay, hold on. We got... Let's go interior lights. Let's light this thing up. Okay, so let's see what we're doing here. Auto hover. Is that a new button? Is that one of those little switch, like flip and switch? Uh, let's see. Cargo lights. Engine. Whoa. That was cool. Hold on. Whoa. Hold on. The camera. Uh, wait, wait, no, 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 we're going, okay, this thing takes off a lot more aggressive than I thought it would, whoa, okay, hold on, hold on, that's not good, that's not good, turn it off, why does it sound like Sonic trying to take off, oh, come on, come on, there we go, okay, okay, uh, let's, uh, let's try that again, that time, uh, or this time without doing what just happened there. Okay, so we got a different plan here. We're going to turn on our lights. Now, we're going to hit this, and then we're going to hit the auto hover here. And let's try to make this thing go out. So here we go. There we go. Come on. Come on. All right. You know, it really does sound like they've updated sounds. I don't remember the game sounding quite like this. Uh, they've had several updates to the alpha since we last played, I believe. Uh, possibly it's a sound update. All right, come on, get out, get out. There we go. All right, let's go. Here we go. Dude, that is cool. Hold on. Let's see if we can get some speed here. All right. Uh, let's see. Can you see? No, you can't see into the back cargo. Uh, that would be kind of cool if you could. Let's go ahead and see what type of speed this thing's got. Oh, uh, this is cool looking. Uh, the turning... I don't know, am I turning this wrong? Let's go ahead and try a couple more adjustments here. There we go. That's what I was looking for. 
All right, so we're doing another test here in Stormworks. I don't know. Like, I'm watching the altitude, and I feel like we're still climbing, but watch what happens. It resets here, which that could just be because we're go we've gone up another... Oh, wait. Yeah, no. Actually, this seems like we've about reached possibly the limit. We're actually in a cloud right now. We're right beside one. What's it like going in a cloud in Stormworks? Is that a thing? I feel like this might need to be something that we need to try. It would be hilarious if it was like a solid object. Uh, let's try this out. Let's go into a cloud. Wow, we are up really high. I'm trying to see if there's a limit. There's like got to be a skybox somewhere around here. Uh, let's go into the cloud. Uh, is it solid? It looks solid, but... Okay, hold on. Nope, nope, it's not solid. Thankfully, it's not. Oh, this is so cool. We're like on top of the world here. All right, so all good things must come to a end. Uh, we're going to do a simulated engine failure up here. Uh, what happens when we click this button and this one? Huh. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, are we just going to dive? Are we just going to nose dive straight down? What the heck? Uh, we're going down, Captain. Is this thing still glide? Do I still have any control here? Nope. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Uh, we're about to see how deep the ocean floor is. Oh! Oh, wait. Wait, what? Are we floating? Hold on. Hey, it floats! <laughs> That's a thing. All right. Yep. Right, we'll just climb out. We'll climb atop the, uh, it's now a vessel, I guess, and we'll wait for rescue. You know, every time I come back to the hangar, the helicopter's in a new position. This time it's on its side and at the back of the hangar. I'm, I'm assuming it's the, uh, the wind coming in. So this had to work really well for our next creation. Uh, we have the Typhoon over here. Let's go ahead and load this up. Uh, this is a BE-55 Typhoon. I believe it's just a, uh, probably a World War II craft here. I'm not too familiar with this one. It looks really good though. I like the shape that he has achieved here with this. Uh, question is, does it work good? Now this might be kind of funny. Okay, let's spawn this. What happens when this is in the wind? <laughs> oh, it's gonna go meet the helicopter. Hold on. Hold on, we gotta do this without wind. We'll, we'll turn the wind back on once we get out of the hangar here. All right, so this is a plane. You know, it didn't take long for people to start building these in Stormworks. I remember when the first Alpha came out, you had some variations of planes, but there's nothing quite like they are. Whoa, this is cool. Yeah, it's nothing quite like they are now, so let's see. Autopilot, wing lights. Turn on those. Okay. All right, so this is pretty basic. You've got an ignition, and you got the autopilot. All right, let's just crank this up. There we go. All right, so I'm assuming... Uh, this is a cool cockpit. Uh, I'm assuming this works pretty standard. Uh oh, oh, no, 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 no. We really, no. Whoa, this thing's got some reverse on it. Hold on. Okay. Let's try to ease it forward. Uh, I'll get back into the throttle here. No, 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 no. Okay. We're going to make it out of this. Uh, man, we really should have just spawned this in again. Nope, that's, that's back. Okay. Uh, turn. Turn. Oh, it's turning. No. No. Wait. Why is the basketball hoop upside down? All right, uh, let's respawn this real quick. All right, here we go. We're gonna try this again. We might actually have to use the end of the uh, the runway here to help take us. Oh no! Come on. All right, let's go full throttle here. Okay, we are we're lifting, right? Okay, that, yeah, that's back is lift. <gasps> there we go. That took a little bit. You know, it'd be really cool, and I think somebody's attempted to do it would be like an aircraft carrier. I know you're not going to get anywhere to full scale because of the, uh, I'm pretty sure it would lag a bit, but it's just like from the inside. Oh, that is cool. Oh, boy. All right, so let me try to get used to flying this and try to figure out what the different controls are real quick. Then maybe we'll, we'll uh, attempt some uh, stunts here or something. All right. We're going to put this thing through its paces here. We are going to attempt a backflip. So, let's see. Let's get a view of the plane here. Here we go. Let's go vertical. I don't know if there's any sort of stalling out. I'm pretty sure there is. And, oh. Oh, boy. Hold on. Can we do this? Hey, check that out. Hey, we didn't lose too much altitude either. <laughs> wow. 
That's pretty cool. You know, they really need to get some multiplayer in this game. This would be amazing in multiplayer. Being able to, like, pilot a ship together or maybe fly helicopters together, airplanes. This game's got uh, endless possibilities. It's still just being worked on at the moment. Uh, let's see. Can we do a barrel roll? Is that a thing? Can we do that? Let's try to get a little bit more altitude before we do that, just in case I, before I uh, nose it into the ground here. All right, here we go. We're going for the barrel roll. Uh-oh, nose. All right, there's one. Going for two. It does seem like we're losing a bit of altitude here, and we're going to lift. Let's go ahead and lift out of it. Hey, I, f I actually look like a good pilot with this. Huh. If anybody knows or anybody's seen anything else that I fly in brick rigs or scrap mechanic, I am a terrible pilot. Can we go through the loop there? Hey, I bet you we can go through the loop on that island. Let's try to do that real quick. All right, we're coming in on the island here. I don't think we're coming in at a very good angle, but still, we're doing it. We're doing this. We're in it to win it. We are committed to getting through that little, uh, little hole there. I think we can, uh, uh-oh. Hold on. Can we make it through this? Oh, yeah, we can make it. Yeah, we're going to do this. All right, here we go. Yeah! <laughs> I mean, that wasn't that impressive, but still, yeah. <laughs> That's a thing. All right, I got one more trick up my sleeve here I want to try out. And I'm curious. I don't know how something in the air like this, when it doesn't seem like when you crash into the water, it's actually affected too bad. So I'm curious if we can just dip ourselves into the water and shoot back out. Uh, let's go, uh, let's do it right here. Seems like a good area, so we're gonna go, boop, bloop, and we're gonna angle it up. What happens when we do that? Oh, yeah, we're magic, folks. Uh, yeah, we are, uh, we're doing it with the physics here. <laughs> that is awesome. All right, well, I think it's time to, uh, land this, and we're gonna see how good of a, uh, pilot Komodo is, because, uh, landing is not my, well, actually, nothing's my strong suit when it comes to flying, but landing definitely isn't, uh, isn't that. It normally ends up with me uh, hitting like a tree or something. Thankfully, I don't think there's too many trees here in Stormworks. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and decrease the throttle here. Oh, this is probably about one of the worst angles I've seen uh, coming in for a landing. Oh, okay. All right, here we go. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. <laughs> Wait. Huh? Wait. What? Wait, what? I, d I, don't, I don't get what's happening here. Okay, so, you know, I feel like this is morally based off of, like, helicopter physics, and people have just made planes with them, and they work, but that's something. Okay, well, that's a good parking job there. Let's go ahead and, uh, let's kill the ignition. We're gonna ignore anything that we actually just saw there. Yeah, that's a thing. All right, let's move on to the next one. All right, so, one of the last creations here. This is called the Speed Rail. I don't know what that means. It says the boat is really fast, and... Huh? I, I don't... I don't understand. Okay, it's got like buoys on it. It's got rails, obviously. Uh, hence the speed rail. The question is, how fast is this boat? Do we have the fastest boat in the game? Is this like a speed boat? You know, I don't think I've actually seen any speed boats. Uh, huh. Is the speed rail supposed to float? Isn't that what buoys do? Hold on. And the sea rail is at the... Uh, uh, this is actually, the speed rail's at the bottom of the ocean here. Okay, let's go down. Alright, so let's get in the pilot seat. How does this doohickey work? Okay, engines and lights. Okay, lights. Engines. Hmm, this is odd. What? Wait, what? What the? Oh! Okay, it floats now. Hey, that's, uh, that's different. That is, uh, that's... <laughs> What the heck? Okay, so, you know, it's pretty fast. It's hard to judge. I mean, I feel like, actually, we are going fast. Yeah, I don't think there's much more that's this powerful in uh, Stormworks. Uh, is there any other switches in here? This is really odd. Oh, yeah, we're definitely, we're booking right now. This might be one of the fastest boats in the game. Uh, let's see. Okay, so the speed rail has one fatal flaw to it. And that is the whole fact that, uh, it doesn't turn. Uh, we are on a crash course with an island here. It's weird, the game's actually, it's chugging in a weird way on the water. It's like, it has these little slowdowns. It's like we're almost moving probably too fast for it. I mean, it's not terribly fast, but 
It's pretty fast. We'll call it that. Uh, question is, it looks like we actually are turning slightly, so we might actually avoid the, uh, the reactor island, which is, uh, probably for the best. Anyways, folks, that's gonna wrap it up for this episode of Stormworks. We will be doing some more of these, uh, episodes soon, uh, checking out some workshop creations. I will be returning to career mode. I just want to grind away a little bit in my free time and get it to where we have enough money where we can build or buy something big. Because ultimately, the missions are somewhat different as far as the stories, uh, but a lot of them right now are the go out into the middle of the water and rescue somebody, and I do that a lot with the helicopter, so it does get a little boring to watch to me. I'd rather watch some different creations, so that's why we're doing this here today. Uh, but like I said, we will be returning to the career mode here soon. But yeah, if you like to like and subscribe, everything helps my channel. If you want more Stormworks on the channel, uh, let me know down in the comments below. I do actually enjoy this game quite a bit. I'm really uh, eager for new updates and seeing what else they add to it. But yeah, hope you guys have a great day, and we will see you guys next time in Stormworks. Thank you.